Hi guys, my name is Crystal and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you like my videos, please smash that like button. Please do subscribe. Um, we're here on a uh, Wednesday morning and I'm tired. But I refuse to get cross or lose my temper because someone thinks it's a game they're playing, right? Getting this poor disabled woman that's lost all her children, living by herself, all in a tizzy and a to-do, so that they can play games and have fun. Well, I'm going to show them up for the cruel bastards that they are. Excuse the French. And they know what I mean by that. So before I went out to take Max, my dog, out for a walk, Spencer Pratt. Spencer Pratt, if anyone's interested, Spencer Pratt is on Snapchat. I don't think Diana Spencer was a Pratt, do you? Does anyone think Diana Spencer was a Pratt? A pussy. So Spencer Pratt notifies me that, you know, he's got a post on Snapchat. Snapchat. Spencer Pratt. And we all know Princess Diana did not like cameras in her face, did she? She wanted to live a quiet life away from the limelight and to get away from the paparazzi. So I take Max on the field, I take him for a walk. There's nobody on there. Usually the elderly couple are on there doing a circuit around. I thought, yeah, I don't like the look of this. Don't like the look of this at all. It's completely bare. Then I see this big triangle constructed out of pieces of wood and there's three or four workmen and one of them's got a triangular hood over his head. So he's got an orange coat on and it's sticking up like a triangle over his head. It looks like a witch's coven, like they're circled round some kind of weird macabre object, really. So I, I thought, right, same as the other day, you've got men in orange gear on the field i'm just going to walk around the field there wasn't another person there was five or six men i walked past a car that had its radio blaring with some american channel american news channel i walked past that then i let max off the lead to have a run if anything max has had a brilliant walk he's had a had a run about so i'm glad about that and then i carried on walking and you could hear the workers over over where the water is because i did a video yesterday of the trucks and the forklifts you could hear some of the workers over there going uh they don't realize that what they're saying carries over the water so if they shout profanities or they're speaking it carries so i can hear what they're saying so while i'm stood across the water i can it, their voice is carrying i can hear them i can hear what they're saying and they're not really shouting but it travels sound travels science go through your science sound travels so i can hear what they're saying across the water they might not realize it but i can so i walk past them and then you've got three blokes around this triangle with a white vehicle and they're taking the piss out of my mother they're using me i'm not jennifer so they're taking the piss out of my mother and my mother isn't even living here because when I went out of this block of flats this white vehicle reversed back as I was walking and my mother Jennifer got run over by a white car at Durrell Gardens in Chatham 
She wasn't living in Rochester when a white car ran her over. So they played games. I told you they're still doing it. They're still doing it, making out I'm my mother. It can only be fraud or drugs or both. Fraud, drugs or both. It's usually fraud and it's usually drugs involved in it somewhere. My mum has not been to the dentist for over 20 years. She's, uh, th she hasn't been to the doctors for three. And doctors and dentists know if you're on drugs. It's not rocket science to see if someone's taking drugs or abusing prescription medication, is it? That something is being hidden here and covered up. My name is Genestra, not Jennifer. And neither is my name Alice. Someone on TikTok is calling me Alice. My name's not Alice. You need to get your facts straight before you start bullying someone and attacking them for the wrong reasons. These people are thick, they're stupid, but they're dangerous. Absolutely thick. So, there you go. So, you know Jennifer Aniston, right? I think someone's been infatuated with my mother, Jennifer, because Jennifer Aniston is the same age as me. Jennifer Trower, my mother, is 78. 78! I'm the same age as Jennifer Aniston, and she is in her 50s. Someone has been obsessed with my mother for years. You've got Jennifer Aniston, Jennifer Hudson, Jennifer Jones, which is round where my mum's... Uh, 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 Jennifer Jones was born around my mum's era. Jennifer Jones. Which Carl, Carl, my ex-boyfriend, had Jennifer Jones on his laptop. Jennifer Jones. So, well, makes you wonder who they were sending these dirty, smelly, stinky guys to, or think they were sending them to. And that Charlie with no teeth and no hair, yeah, my mum, it'd suit my mum. So all those dates I went on, or what I thought were dates, they were ab trying to abuse my mother, or thinking they were abusing my mother. And using me. And now they're getting very quite nasty, trying to drive onto the pavement and trying to run me over. And that is why I take the camera out every day. Some of these workmen have gone into to the um, co-op and started kicking cabinets and being aggressive when I'm in there. Trying to intimidate me to shut my mouth and keep go along with it, if you know what I mean. Go along with it. I'm not going along with it. I'm not being abused anymore. And I'm going to visit my mother. My father's dead. So if they want to send the dog grooming van out again, um, I'll show you it. When I go up to see my mama, my mother, Jennifer, if they send the dog grooming van out again, I'll show you it out the window. Very nasty people. But then you must realise when, when grooming gangs, paedophile gangs, grooming gangs lose, lose 
their victim, they go and hunt it. They don't want to lose it, so they go and hunt it. Hunt it down and harm it. I believe it was either a paedophile gang in the internet, internet back in early 2000s when the internet first started or some underhand shit that was after my kids not me as a date but they were after my children these blokes were coming like from Derby Yorkshire and I uh, Wales so I don't know what the hell this is but it's not right see you later